you know you're in college, Adam. <laughs> you're not actually supposed to be getting eight hours of sleep. Up, study, no. <laughs> Party, treat yourself stupid, do something. Fine, ignore me. This is just unfair. Isn't the afterlife supposed to be exciting? <coughs> Why can't I just haunt some old building where people will actually listen to me? I know you can't help it. I, I just. <clears throat> you should seriously throw this out. It would be healthy for you. It's been what? Three years? Almost three. June 3rd, 22, January 8th, 2012. God, you dated the fucking bat. Just don't, don't hate me, all right? Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to wake you up. I don't sleep, remember? Ghost? And he could use the company. you get to sleep? I'm not sure. An hour ago, maybe? Something like that. Where are you? Out. With my friends. Have you actually been out at all this semester? Sure I have. Library doesn't count. <laughs> oh. Well, I go out as much as I like, okay? I just like staying in. Fine. I'll leave it alone. <laughs> if you can name one friend you brought over in the last five months. Oh, yeah, yeah, that one's easy, yeah. You. <laughs> now go drop my social life, please. Fine. Whatever, Adam. I'll try to keep it down. Let you get back to your sleep if you're that tired. No, I, I need to finish this. God, I'm starving. <laughs> you want some pizza? I'll pay if you call. Lazy brat, isn't he? Sometimes I wonder why he even has a phone. He acts like talking to another human being will literally kill him. Come on, man, that's not fair. What? Uh, that you always pay. Uh, let me get it this time, okay? Wonderful say. Well, I'd never say no to free food, for sure. Yeah, definitely. I will pay anything to get out of the dining hall for a night. Oh, a very wise choice. The food here is pretty shit. Look at him whining. As if pizza every night is any better. Tell him to suck it up. No. What? Uh, food on campus, it's not that bad. You just said That is, uh, the dining hall is bad, but there's that burrito place, that's pretty good, and there's, uh, sushi. Oh. <laughs> no offense, Ben, uh, but you grew up in Vermont, right? That garbage is not sushi, mm -hmm. it's chewy cardboard. Yeah. <laughs> and God, don't even start on the Mexican food. Don't Trust me, <laughs> I won't. If you miss California so much, don't go there. He'll 
get all emotional. Are you okay? You're acting really strange. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm just tired. Uh, midterms are coming up. I haven't gotten much sleep, you know. Uh, studying. 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 Right, studying. Um, look, Ben, you haven't touched your books in days. Are you sure you're okay? Oh, shit! Uh, yeah, I'm sure. Why? He thinks you're high. I'm just worried. You've been very odd lately. Why would he... Why would you think that? <laughs> because you look pretty high. Well, you kind of talk to nothing and keep jumping around. Look, what's that? <laughs> what's going on? You can tell me if you need help or, or anything. It's nothing, seriously. Oh, I've got it. Tell him your uncle died. My, uh... Go on, it'll work. He'll feel bad for you and shut up. Would you just stop already? What? Not you. Analyzing me, could you just stop it? If I were acting like you, you would be worried too. I know you're worried about me, but I don't need this right now. I'm just trying to help you, Ben. I know, I, look, I know I sound fucking crazy, all right, but it's just because I'm stressed. Well, talking about it could help. If I needed your help, I promise <laughs> I would have asked for it. Just because you think that you don't need it. Mm. Fuck. Mm. What? It's my dad. Mm. Fuck, just take this. Say hi for me. Mm. Hello? No. Dad, I told you already. I'm spending the break with a friend. Would you listen to me, please? Ooh, Explain that. and that's not going to be pretty. He's going to be in a shitty mood when he gets back. Great, Lucas. What the hell? What did you do that for? Me? I didn't do anything. None of that would have happened if it weren't for you distracting me. Well, pardon me for not sitting in silence whenever you have company. <laughs> You're the first person I've been able to interact with in three years, Ben. You have no idea what it's like to be ignored for that long. God damn it, look. Stop trying to make me feel guilty. Why, it works. You don't think I have problems, too? You're still breathing. Oh, you are such an asshole. So, aside from haunting our apartment and making me look like a complete psycho, have you been up to anything? Any progress? <laughs> really? You're still on that? Look, I'm not going anywhere. Lucas. I'm not! I don't want to move on or see the light. Or any other bullshit. Look, this might be really fucking boring, but at least we're all here. Didn't you try talking to Adam? I know you can't exactly hold a conversation, but I thought you were going to try talking it all out. Yeah, I tried. And, uh... Surprise, surprise. It didn't work. You're never going to figure out why you're stuck here if you don't actually try. You act like I want to. I don't. I don't care. I'm not going anywhere. You don't have anyone you want to see? Grandparents, aunt, uncle, God? Not at all. The only people I want to be with are right here. What's wrong with that? I don't want to go. And it's none of your fucking business! Why are you so fixated on sending me away? Because you fucking hate it here. You Don't do tell me what you I- You do nothing but complain! You're miserable! Just look at you. Do you want to be alone forever? There is no fix, okay? You're dead. Even if he could see you, that won't change the fact that you're still rotting six feet underground back in California. What the fuck is wrong with you? You don't just say shit like that, you. Fuck. You're wrong, you know. What? I was cremated, not buried. Not that I waited around to watch. And even if lecturing me makes you feel any better, none of this matters because I don't even know how I'm supposed to move on. Ugh. We've tried to figure it out and we've gotten nowhere. Holding on isn't helping. And what will? These... Other than you, Adam is all I have. Hey, uh, I was out anyway, so 
Here, listen, Adam, I'm sorry about all that. No, it's, it's fine. I shouldn't have been bothering you. Are you kidding? I'm lucky you've actually got my bag. Thank you, really. Oh. Well, thank you. You're welcome. Now, go grab a slice before you get all mushy on me. Let me guess. Pepperoni and mushroom. Perfect. So, uh, your dad's still being a pain about Christmas? Yeah, what else? It's not like he ever calls unless he has something to yell at me about. You're still pissed that I didn't go home for Thanksgiving. I do all the usual bullshit. We just want one of our children home for the holidays. Ugh. I'm sorry, you shouldn't have to listen to my family drama. Hey, hey, don't worry about it, man. You saw plenty of mine over Thanksgiving. The image of my brother mooning the quad is still burned into my retinas. That's your brother, right? Um, yeah, that's him. Ben, don't. You don't really talk about him much. Shut up, Ben, there's no point! No, I, I guess I don't. I don't know what to say. I thought that we were close enough that I should know how to describe him, but it's been... When we were kids, we moved around so much that it was hard making friends, so we spent most of our time together. When we got to California, we made friends. You but, made but friends. when he talked, they would look at him like he was, I don't know, some type of freak. He was a bit much for some people. We once listened to Hamlet on audio tape, and, and when it finished, we could recite the whole thing. It's not like that. I'm as normal as you are, okay? That's fucking insane. <laughs> word for word? Word for word. I don't think his mind helped him know it. It just made him different. And people just thought he was crazy. One time, um, I was in a fight with one of our friends over something she said. She kept denying it until Lucas came over with the exact date and time and quoted her verbatim. He was just standing up for me, but after that, they kind of turned their backs on him. So he started taking any pills that slowed him down enough to be around them. I knew something was up, but I didn't realize. If I had a, I, I would have, or he could have. <sighs> all right, listen, I know he wasn't perfect at all. Pretty arrogant. I, I think he liked making people feel inferior. But when he cared about something, he, he'd give it everything he had. He'd spend hours reading about the environment, coming up with plans to save the world, or miss sleep for days just so he could read when nobody else was awake. <laughs> he, was, he was very intense. Ben, make him stop. I'm not some, some martyred savant. And you don't have a right to hear this! Sorry. It's all right. Uh, I haven't talked about any of this in years. It's kind of nice. Yeah, no, no, it's not nice, but something, anyway. I think it liked you. Maybe. Uh, it's going to be more about a lot in the year or so before. You know, I'm sure it wasn't your fault, Adam. Maybe. It's not like I can find out, is it? And even if it couldn't have helped, I should have noticed my little brother needed me. Stop it! You were trying to help him, weren't you? You didn't abandon him. It feels like it. No, that's not it. I didn't want to hurt you. I... Ben, please, just stop it. You're fucking hurting him. Stop ignoring me! I don't want to make you do this, you know. <laughs> no. I, I want to. Uh, things got to a point where Lucas just stopped caring about anything. He stopped showing up for his classes. He, he started coming home in the middle of the night and drinking himself sick. I didn't know what to do. He kept lying about where he was going and what he was doing. But when it was just us, he was happier. And I kept telling myself that he was going to get better. He seemed healthier. 
even went on for hours about the environment again. And then we spent the whole day out hiking out of wildlife preserve. And in the morning, he had I don't know what happened. I tried, but it didn't matter. Adam, you can't blame yourself for that. If you don't get this thing off your back, you'll have to carry it around for the rest of your life. It's clearly hurting you. Wouldn't your brother hate that? Adam? Adam? Come on! I guess he would. Yeah, he, he'd tell me to get off my ass and stop whining. But he's gone. No, I'm not! I only wanted him to be, fuck if I know, safe and happy and here. I am! I'm, I'm here! I'm right here! I'm Adam! He'd be happier knowing you weren't tearing yourself apart. Man, you'd be too. If you died, you'd want the people you love to feel good when they thought of you, right? You don't have to beat yourself up to remember him. It's not that easy. I can't just wake up and decide to let him go. Don't. I mean, not that you could, but that's not what I meant. I'm not asking you to stop caring or missing him, but obviously this isn't working. You can't just forget about him or move on, but we can still try to make things a little better, okay? Okay. okay. 